checks his ash. He totally looks like he's wearing his clothes for the X and Y series. As you can see, his cap, you make it clear. There's another half shaped circle that is black. With red cap. He wears his blue jacket. With no blue sleeves printing on its arms. And he also wears his light blue trousers instead of dark blue trousers. And he also hold his white technique ball piece can be used as a pokeball. Next his red trainer which is based from the Pokemon Red, Blue and Yellow version on this classic Game Boy game from Nintendo. He wears his red cap with a printed white half circle shape on it with the green line. He's wearing the same as Ash Ketchum from the classic series. He wears his... Oh, let me make it clear. He wears his red jacket with no white sleeves printing on its arms. He wears his blue trousers and he also hold his white technique ball piece can be used as a pokeball. Next is the first guy who dressed as as Jesse. Make it clear. That's it. He wears his. She wears her magenta cap with a white half circle shape on it with a letter R on it. She has a nice lip on her mouth. She wears her white jacket with no sleeves printing on its arm. There's the letter R. Stands for Team Rocky. He also wears his white trousers. She also wears two white gloves. And she also holds her red technique ball piece can be used as a pokeball. And lastly, here's that second guy who dressed as James. Let me make it clear. He wears his violet cap with a printed white half circle shape on it with a letter R on it. He wears his 
white jacket with no sleeves printing on its arms. He wears his white trousers and he also holds his red technique ball piece can be used as a poker ball. If I take a look at the letter R printing on its body, just take a look at it. If you think about this, just tell me in the comic section below. This minifigures and iPhone sets comes with eight Pokemons from the classic series. They are made out of bootleg Lego bricks. First I'm going to take a look at Pikachu. Come on, make it there. That's it. I think it's Ash's Pikachu. There's a nice printing tail on its brick and this other small piece has a nice printing Pikachu's face on it. Pikachu can walk with its arms and legs with small round pieces underneath him. There are some two Teeth bricks, pieces for its ears, so I don't see black on its ears. And look at this grey pieces attaches for its tail. These Pokemon model figures are standing on each of these small light green base plate. For its ground. Next I'm going to take a look at Gengar. Take a look at Gengar's legs. Make it better, make it better. That's it. You can see the small round small round pieces for its legs that are cream instead of purple. There's a nice printing of Gingar's face on its purple one X two brick. As you can see there's 
you can see the drips that came out of Gingar's mouth. Take to look at the roof, small roof bricks for Gingar's ears. Take a look at Gingar's arm. If you don't know about this brick for Gingar's arms, just tell me in the comic section below. Next, I'm going to take a look at Evie. Take a look at Evie's tail. This tail that looks so better. Evie, you can see Evie was wearing bat ears and bat head. Which was based from the Lego Haunted minifigures set. Evie was wearing a round 2x4 plate piece for its fur round its neck take a look at Evie's legs They are yellow instead of brown. It was these two small yellow round pieces for its legs.